Welcome to our child dedication. If you would like to join us, come on in. Find a seat here in the center section to show your support um, for our families who are about to take part in something so amazing this morning. I absolutely love, love, love child dedication because we get to follow in the same footsteps as Jesus. Because Jesus wasn't first baptized with water. We see the story in the Bible where Jesus was taken to the temple and Mary and Joseph dedicated him to the call and the anointing that was on his life. And that's what we have the awesome ability to be able to do here this morning. These families are taking that step to say we commit to raise our children in a godly manner, in a way that honors the Lord. But they understand that they can't do it alone, and that's what's so beautiful to be part of a church family. Extended family who's here, welcome. Thank you so much for partnering behind your family. Church family, thank you for being an extension of Jesus in this so that we can support these families and help them to raise their children in the way that they should go. Let's get this thing started. William, our wild one, the joy that you bring to our family is unspeakable. You are named after your grandfather, but your spirit is surely like no one else before. You are so full of life and personality. You march to the beat of your own drum. Born with music in your soul, we thank God for the purpose he has set before you. My darling, you are a game changer. There is no spirit of timidity in you, a child born to move mountains. We know that you will carve your own path through this world. We pray that you keep your eyes transfixed on God, being a light to everyone around you, leaning not on your own understanding, but letting God direct your path. William, you are God's masterpiece, a child crazy enough to change the world. We pray that you have a firm understanding of your gifts and abilities, but above all, remember that with Christ, all things are possible. We love you, Mommy and Daddy. <laughs> Emma, we love you so much. Your name means whole and complete, and that is what you have done to our family. You have made our home complete. We vow to love you unconditionally, give you grace as you grow, and relentlessly challenge you to become the woman that God has created you to be. We are already so proud of you and love you so much. Love, Mommy and Daddy. <laughs> to our dearest Tessa, you are a little unexpected miracle. We are so blessed and beyond thankful to be your parents. You are the definition of a happy baby, and we are so excited to watch you grow into the beautiful person God has created you to be. Tessa, spelled backwards, is asset, something of great value, but in this case, someone. That's you. And, meaning he, God, has favored me. It also refers to grace. You are so special and uniquely created by God. Our hope for you is that your heart will be tender to God and the things concerning our Lord from a young age. We promise to consistently pray for you and, will, and with you along this journey. We thank God for you, Tessa. We love you so much. Your mommy and daddy, Simone and Rob. At this time, we want to ask our pastors to come up and spray, pray a special prayer of blessing and dedication over each child and their families. Father, in the name of Jesus, they brought their son to you, to dedicate him to you, Father. Oh, Father, another generation 
that will grow and declare the works of God. You started with them, and you're continuing in their seed. And so, Father, we dedicate William to you right now in the name of Jesus, that he will be bold and courageous and represent you wherever he goes, that even that entrepreneurial spirit that's on the Father would be on the Son. In the name of Jesus, that he would be a builder of your kingdom, Father. Oh, we give you praise for your protection and covering his purpose in Jesus' name. Blessing upon blessing be upon him in Jesus' name. Yeah, we're not going to try it with her. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Father God, we just pray over the Fitzgerald family. We just thank you for this moment of dedication, Father God. We thank you for your strength. We thank you for your wisdom and revelation knowledge to this baby. Father God, we thank you that she's going to be built up in your kingdom ways, Father God, and lead others in your ways, Father. I just thank you that all of her gifts are going to shine forward for your kingdom, to build your kingdom here on planet Earth, Father God. We just thank you and praise you that we can see it even before it happens, Father God, that we're here as a, as a uh, church united, a family together, Father God, agreeing that your ways will be worked out. Through this one, in Jesus' name, amen. It's for the things of the kingdom. And it's not going to be a curiosity that, that goes in the negative. Oh, no, curious to discover, curious to uncover in the name of Jesus. And she's going to be a trailblazer of some kind in the things that she hears and sees from you in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you. For that gift to see, even as mom has the gift to see. And so it shall be with Emma in the name of Jesus. And she will, she will deliver and she will see, even with what her name says, with grace. In the name of Jesus, I give you praise for my father in the name of Jesus again this family brought this baby to you it's an act surrendering their child to you God dedicating their child to you it's a solemn moment God and I thank you in the name of Jesus for your seal of approval your favor that rests on Tess in the name of Jesus Lord I just keep seeing the word bridge, bridge, a bridge, even as these two cultures have come together and they so represent who you are, that she will be a bridge for people in Jesus' name. She'll see things and bring such healing and actually restoration amongst people in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you that her purpose is secure. Lord, she's under the prayer covering of this church. She shall fulfill the days of her life in your purpose and in your plan. And she is dedicated fully to you. Blessing upon blessing on her in Jesus' name. So what we like to do uh, with everyone in here is do a declaration together for uh, the dedication service. So if you can, actually it's on the screen, so um, we'll, let's read this together actually. Instead of after me, I'll count to three and then we'll read this together, okay? So we're declaring this with the families over the children, all right? We've got a 
prompter there or the side screens, wherever you guys can see it. So one, two, three. Father, in Jesus' name, we believe that as we train up our children in your ways, they will not depart from them when they are old. We thank you for the wisdom, guidance, and strength in the training of our children. We reverence and delight in your ways, and so our children will be mighty in the land, successful in all they do. They will be the generation of the blessed. Our children will have a long, full, healthy, prosperous life. And then we seal it with, in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for all being here. And the church has uh, gifts for you as you guys uh, walk off. There you go. Awesome. Give them one more hand as they walk out. <laughs>